Good evening and welcome back once again. So today we're playing Villarreal B. Last time we had a disappointing draw against Alaves, dominated the game, we're winning 1-0 and we let a goal in. I think it was about the 87th or 88th minute, so we don't drop too many points. So let's move on from that and crack on with the league. And it's a full strength lineup today, no changes needed, let's jump into the match. And here we are against Villarreal B. Obviously we played uh, their main team a few matches ago, beat them in the semi-final of the Copa del Rey to get to the, the final against Barcelona, which is in... Well, we've got this match, and I think... I uh, can't remember, is it one or two more league matches? And then it's the, the final massive match. But after that draw in the last match, letting in a very, very late goal with, I think... Potentially the only shot and target they had. Want to do a lot better in this game. But just didn't kill it off. And doesn't matter who you're playing. If you're only leading by one goal. There's always just that risk. Didn't expect to be uh, defending so early. Good tackle from Vieira. And Mudrick's on the run there. Uh, plays it through to Xerxy. Oh, good save. Went for power rather than placement. Maybe the finesse shot would have been the way to go. Beautiful counter-attack, though. We had been saying that... Um, Mudrick's been a little bit absent as of lately, just in matches. But he did get on the score sheet the other day, which is good to see. I think if all of our players want absolutely firing on all cylinders, I think Mudrick's probably the most dangerous. But we've got some great players. Perez has been on absolute fire lately. I think he's offside there. Is he? Didn't get it anyway. Six, he's very consistent. Consistently getting on the score sheet or assists. He very rarely has periods now where he's not scoring or not being involved. Even if he's not actually getting on the score sheet, he's contributing to the team the majority of the time. That's a poor ball from Hetch. He is going in the summer, Hetch. There's not going to be many of the original lineup left. A couple of youngsters. Arcas will be the main one from uh, the actual main team. But we have brought some up from the Thief squad. Good tackle there. Just over. Overran it. It was an easy tackle actually. Nicely played out from the back. It's fairly even so far. Well, we're starting to get into it. But... Um, Having some good possession. Lovely header from Cosano. Mudrick. Oh, good save. Really nice play, though. Vieira to Perez. Back into Vieira from Mudrick. And again, a decent save to the keeper's right. Comfortable. But we're definitely looking the more threatening now. Can Zixi get on it? Not quite. Well, this could be dangerous. Well, the defender just shepherded them out there. I dropped off and, and brought one of my players using square towards him and I covered the uh, the passing angle. I need to do that more. I'm not the best at defending. I know we don't let in a lot of goals, but um, that's mainly from just the possession and me attacking them. Attack being a better form of defence. 
Oh, is there seen Ellie in there? Just didn't quite react. So yeah, we've had, like I say, the better of the, well, the last probably 20 minutes. A couple of chances, some good saves. But they do look like they could potentially be dangerous. Good tackle there from Kosanu. Plays it through to Mudrik. Mudrik. Oh, just wide. Somehow find the space. Stopped his run here. Slowed it down. And then sped back up. Oh, that was so close. That was a very good angle to watch the replay. I love that. That's what Mudrick is so dangerous at. He can create something out of almost nothing. Well, I was going to say good defending, but they get it back. Getting a massive uh, bit of luck there. Villarreal, I mean, not myself. Because look, I double teamed them, tackled them, and it just deflected about three or four times. Would have been unlucky to let a goal in there. Oh. Great corner. Lovely header. Got to say, poor defending though. Don't know who was supposed to be marking him. Looks like it was Herrera and Cosini was behind, so I'm not sure which one of them. Well, that's a turn up for the books. We did say that we're getting looking a little bit dangerous. Didn't expect it to be maybe on a counter attack. Oh, Zixi, nearly. Perez just behind him. Mudrik. Lovely play and another save. Again, it was just too near the keeper, really. To take share Mudrick. Oh, it's gonna go off a throw in. Well, that definitely wasn't on target. It was a weird angle, but um got all the work to do now. And just look at that. 55% possession to Villarreal. That is, I'm pretty certain the first time we've ever had the less of the possession in a half. Strange. Maybe this is them getting revenge for us beating the the main counterpart in uh, in the semi-final. Uh, just behind her over there. Need a reset. Oh, nice ball into it. Xerxes couldn't quite take it. Got to do better there. But we'll reset again. Ooh, nearly intercepted. And then we get tackled. Yeah, the danger is we could let in a second. Pushing people up. And the way they've been playing. They've, they've... Well. We've got to say they've probably been the better team overall. Nice ball out wide to Perez. Sixty. There it is. One one. Been fighting for it. And uh, I was starting to get a little bit worried, but Carlos Perez. Nice cut back. Simple ball and a really nice finish. The, their keeper's been probably their best player so far. So it's taken a very accurate goal to, to beat him this time. Power and pace in the, the bottom right. The 
pass that offside. What? There's no way that's a free kick. I've got my head taken off there as well. Some of the free kick decisions are very strange in this game. Here's Vieira. Nice ball out wide to Perez. Oh, it's a poor ball though. It's a dangerous place to give it away in midfield. Setting ourselves up for being hit on the counter attack. And uh, we will make some substitutions as soon as we can. Kind of get the ball off them though. That's a really nice ball out wide. Should just be overran. Yeah, we'll make some subs now. So we're changing Carlos Perez to be up front. Putting Bajero on for Xerxes on the right. Fabio Vieira is going off for Hamilton. Bringing on Arcas for Hitch. Pushing him up, him up a bit higher and dropping Herrera into that uh, defensive midfielder role. We're really going to go for it now. And we've changed the... To be a bit more attacking as well. I don't know what mix up there. You know, this is probably one of the best teams I've played in quite a while. In the league at least. Oh nice ball. Oh, what a save again. Oh, Mudrick nearly getting fouled there. Right, costing new mops up. I think I'm going to start to think about uh, playing Arcas more instead of Hetich and dropping Herrera deep bit. Oh, nearly. Now Mudrick. Oh, that's a foul. That's a foul. How is that not a foul? Just take his legs out there, stopping the attack. Oh, did we not win the ball there? Here's Perez. Through to Mudrik. Again, he's getting his legs taken out. What is going on? I don't know how we're not getting free kicks while penalties. He's getting tripped. And we'll pressure them into giving away a throw in. That's poor. Get it back though. Mudrik. Oh, in between players. Oh, they're so lucky there. They have had the rub of the green. I think they've played really well, but in key moments they've, um, yeah, they've definitely had a little bit of luck. Again, any of the uh, deflections are going their way. Nice tackle. Lovely play. Yeah. Again, getting a shirt pulled. You might not be able to see it, but I can feel it on the uh, on the controller. Here's Arcas. Mudrick. Oh, no, that was actually a good tackle that time. Oh, just wide. Oh my god, that would have been it. Deflected wide. Really good play. Oh, so close. 
This is it now. Uh, don't get all cast to take this. Just don't be too near the keep it. Oh, that's it. Another draw, 1-1. One, one. Totally different than the last one, though. We dominated the last match and, and just letting it freak go towards the end. Um, this one, very different. Yeah, and we only just edged the possession in the end, so certainly a better second half. They only had two shots, one being on target, but I think they played better than what maybe the stats say there. It was certainly their first half. one ones maybe about fair. I think towards the end, we were certainly the one that was going to be the one that's going to win it. Draw is probably a fair result. And Xerxes gets man of the match. Not really a surprise, just with him being on the on the score sheet. And you wouldn't say anyone had an outstanding game. But some good ratings there for Mudrick, Perez, Fabio Vieira, Herrera. That was a really good battle. That's it for today's episode. Bit of a disappointing result, but I actually really enjoyed the match. Bit of a battle. Obviously, you know, winning games 3, 4, 5 nil is great. But those uh, matches where you really tested are probably the most enjoyable ones. And if you look at the bottom there, you can see we've got a match at home in the league and then the big Copa del Rey final against Barcelona the week after. Looking at the table, we're now on 98 points, so nearly above that 100-point threshold. Hopefully we'll get that in the next match. But like the video if you did enjoy it. Drop a comment down below. Think about subscribing. And I'll see you all next time. Cheers.